you are welcome again to our YouTube channel. For today's video, we are going to be teaching you how to draft a basic body pattern. This basic body patterns will enable you to sew any style. By the time you manipulate them, you will be able to get any style of your choice. But we are going to divide this basic pattern into three parts. The beginner's class first. The first beginning, how to start, how do you draft body patterns? This is what you are going to be working on. The first things you do before you can draft a basic body pattern. A free hand pattern cannot convert to a basic body pattern. A basic body pattern, you need accuracy. When you go to those measurements, the tape will convert it into a decimal point. This is where we need those conversion because every part of that conversion is needed to make this body pattern accurate. Mm -hmm. If you are new to this our channel, remember to subscribe, like, share our video, and drop your comments. If you have any difficulties, you can ask us questions in our comment section. So follow us as we go into the lesson proper. So, the materials we need for this tutorial is our rulers, we have short, medium, and the longest one. We need our pencil, eraser in case there is mistake. We need curve, protractor. These are the things we need for this tutorial. So when you are drafting a basic body pattern, you first of show that you have your pattern paper. And this pattern paper should be able to give you your front and the back. You are cutting it as if it is a fold. So you ensure that this is my paper right here. I'm going to be working on both the front and the back. That is why we need paper that will give us a measurement. It means we need three inches extra from your measurement. Any paper you are going to use should be about three inches bigger than your real measurement in order to curtail your pattern. So as we go straight into the lesson of today, we are going to take our measurements. This is the measurement we need for this basic body pattern. We are going to be using balls 43, 4, 8, other balls 36, 4, 8, chairs, 40, 6, 8, waist, 36. We have our abdomen here, which is 38. Hip, 43, 4, 8. Bust point, 11, 4, 8. So, in order for us to get accurate measurements, we will first of all mark our top line. Our top line, you start the measurement from the edge of the paper. You measure two inches. Measure these two inches in three points. In three points. Measure it. Then you draw a straight line. These three points, you connect them to give you accuracy, a straight line. That's why we measure it in three places. I ensure you follow those points in talks. So, so this is our top line. While we draw this top line, two inches is to enable us to have space in case there is any adjustment. 
you have space to use over here. Then the first line we draw we're taking a drafting pattern is our full front leg. The full front leg of this measurement, the full front leg is 18 for 8. This is 18. 18 for 8 is 18 and a half. Then this 18 and a half, you equally mark in three points. Three points. You connect. You can see why we need the uh, different different sizes of ruler in order to get a straight line. That is our full front let. Full front let means half let of, of your blouse. There from your half let. You take your hip depth. The hip depth of this measurement is eight. Then you mark eight from the waist in three places. Also, you mark eight. I connect the lines. Then I connect the line. This is your heel depth of this pattern. Connect the three lines together. So you can see that we are drafting the horizontal lines of our body. Just watch out how this thing will form our bodies at the end of the day. From our previous video, if you have not watched it, please, this is very important. Try and watch our previous video. From these bodies, the next line we need to draw here is the chest line the next line we need to draw here now is the bust line then if you check our previous measurements our video you will discover that we measure as we take full front length measurements so also we took the back measurements so in this video we are going to divide back measurement into two a minus one. That is our bust line. Our back length of this measurement is 16. That is from our knee to our waist. Is 16. So if you divide 16 into two, it will give us eight. Eight minus one is seven. You will draw that seven from the waistline upward. Mark in three places for accuracy. So we mark in three places. We mark in three places. I connect. This is our boss line. This is our boss line. Please always go back to our conversion. And if you have not subscribed to this our channel, 
subscribe to our channel watch our previous video because it's actually from beginners classes from beginners to advanced classes now this is beginners class we are still working on the advanced classes will come on this same pattern we will be showing you how to manipulate how to put the darts the chest that the waist that the ammo that please follow us on this channel you will benefit a lot from us